Hare Krishna. Was Karna a better archer than Arjuna? Answer Let's look at the various occasions when they faced off and what results were there uh, to be to evaluate who was the better archer. So broadly there were five occasions when there was uh, there were some kind of face off or some kind of comparison of their performances. So the first encounter was of course at the martial exhibition when Drona uh, had all the students exhibit the skills that they had learned in his academy. At that time Arjuna by his military by his archery skills astonished everyone and at that time Karana gate crashed into that uh, exhibition and demanded the opportunity to be allowed to exhibit his own skill saying that he would exceed whatever Partha had done. So once he was granted the opportunity he managed to equal whatever Arjuna had done not, not exceed it as he had as he had bragged earlier. But thereafter, he demanded an opportunity to have a direct duel with Arjuna. Arjuna immediately grabbed his bow and was ready to fight. But the whole day there had been the martial exhibition. And by the time the logistics were being worked out for this duel to take place, uh, the sun set and thus the duel was put off. So basically, uh, this was a draw. Now Arjuna and uh, Karana equal Arjuna's ability. So if we keep a score, then here the score will remain Arjuna 0, Karana 0. The next uh, occasion where their skills could, could be compared was uh, soon afterwards uh, when Drona was approached by his students, both the Kauravas and the Pandavas, and they were, uh, were asked, what uh, Takshina can we give you? So, Drona had an old rivalry with Drupada and Drona told them that uh, you have Drupada arrested and brought before me as a prisoner. So, the Kauravas rushed forward to do his bidding and by this time Duryodhana had befriended Karna. So, Karna also joined Duryodhana uh, and his brothers as they charged upon Drupada's army, uh, Drupada's kingdom. And Drupada uh, he along with his army defeated the Kauravas along with Karna and they had to flee and thereafter the Pandavas uh, went forward and uh, led by Arjuna they fought so fiercely that Drupada's army was soon overwhelmed and Drupada was brought uh, arrested before Drona and, uh, as Drona had requested. So here here we have Drupada defeated Karna and Arjuna defeated Drupada. So indirectly in their face of Arjuna proved himself to be much better than Karna. Arjuna defeated the person who had defeated Karna, whose army had defeated Karna, defeated that very army. So uh, we could say the score here is Arjuna 1, Karna 0. The next confrontation between the two happened at Draupadi's Swayamvar. In that Swayamvar, the, the uh, Pandavas had still been in hiding. Uh, they were in disguise because an attempt to murder them had been made uh, of some, uh, a few months ago when they were in Varnavart. They had been attempted to be burned alive. And since that time, they had been living incognito. So when all uh, the Kshatriyas uh, the, who, who, were, who attempted, they could not succeed in getting Draupadi's hand, then Arjuna as a Brahmana, he, uh, he attempted and he met the target, he shot the target and then the kings became furious. They felt that uh, Draupadi had humiliated them and therefore they came to attack Draupadi. So at that time, when they were charging towards Drupada, Yudhishthir told his brothers that now Drupada is our father-in-law and we have a duty to protect him. So what did they do? So Bhima and Arjuna being the foremost of the warriors among the Pandavas, they immediately sprang forward to the defense of Drupada. And Bhima, uh, he fought against, the, the kings were led by Shalya 
and he fought against them and he Bhima helped Chalya back whereas eventually as it was initially it was a confused fight but eventually two main uh, agents from the two main representatives of king kept fighting so Shalya fought Bhima and Arjuna fought with Karna and Karna shot arrows lightly initially because he thought this was a Brahmana but when um, uh, Arjuna countered his arrows and Karna shot more arrows and Arjuna countered all of them and then Karna desisted from fighting saying that he said that he doesn't he didn't want to fight against a Brahmana so essentially Karna was not able to prove was not able to get a upper hand over Arjuna so here again there was a draw so the score remains Arjuna 1 Karna 0 the next face off happened when the Pandavas were in exile at that time, in order to humiliate the Pandavas, Arj uh, Duryodhana, Karna, Shakuni, Dushyasan, they all went to the forest and they uh, wanted, to, um, wanted to brandish their wealth and their prosperity before the Pandavas and thus try to show uh, how, try to make the Pandavas feel miserable. So they were intercepted in this attempt by the Gandharvas led by Chitraratha and when Duryodhana insolently uh, disrespected and disregarded the Gandharvas, the Gandharvas attacked and there was a fierce fight and in that fight Karna was bested and wounded and Karna fled and eventually the Gandharvas arrested Duryodhana and one of the soldiers on Duryodhana's side ran over all this happened on one side of the river and on the other side of the river the Pandavas were living in a hermitage and they were Yudhishthira was performing some sacrifices so they ran over and asked Yudhishthira informed Yudhishthira that Duryodhana had been arrested they begged him to rescue him so Duryodhana sent Bhima and Arjuna and Arjuna at that time went at the instruction of Yudhishthira and he fought against the Gandharvas and he defeated the Gandharvas and he released Duryodhana so again here uh, Gandharvas defeated Karna who fled and then Arjuna defeated the Gandharvas so again Arjuna proved superior to the person who had proved superior to Karna so Arjuna proved his uh, superiority to Karna thus so as the score becomes Arjuna 2 Karna 0 the next face off the fifth one ha happened uh, a few months before the Kurukshetra war in the Virat war here Arjuna was the was alone on one side and on the other side was the whole Kuru army and among, in that army Karna was also there and Arjuna single handedly defeated the whole Kaurava army it is probably the most spectacular solitary performance by any warrior in the whole Mahabharat and Karna at that time attacked once ferociously and he was he was repelled and he had to fall back wounded he retreated and then smarting at the insult he attacked again and a second time also he was totally overcome and again he had to fall back so here Arjuna won fair and square even when the odds were overwhelmingly against him because he was one warrior fighting against an entire army so thus, uh, the score becomes Arjuna 3, uh, Karna 0. So on no occasion did Karna ever uh, defeat Arjuna. And therefore, uh, to say that Karna was a better archer is simply a matter of unsubstantiated opinion. If you look at facts, unambiguously Arjuna established himself as the superior archer when compared with Karna. Thank you. Hare Krishna.